Hi, this is my Black & Decker steam mop from Delivery was quick and at a convenient time. Um, to assemble this was very easy for me. I didn't even need to get my husband to do it. So to tell you how, how easy and quick it was for me to set it all up. Um, this comes with a user manual. It tells you everything you need to know about setting up the, the steam mop. Okay, it comes with different accessories. First of all, there's an extra mop. Um, cleaning pad if you look down here there's one there so this is an extra one once that one gets dirty you pop it into the washing machine and um, it gives a very good clean there is a measuring cup if you look here there's a max that's where the water you have to fill up the water to and after filling the water you put it into here you just pour it in there and it tells you the required amount okay so this machine is very good it uses only water and it kills 99.9% .9 of germs, okay? There's also a carpet glider. You place this over the cleaning pad and you glide it over your carpet and it gives a really, really, really good clean. There's a flexible hose handle. This, I use this when I use the, um, the handheld steam cleaner. It just makes it a bit more easy and then you can attach all the other nozzles to it. The small squeegee, I use this one for the windows and the mirrors. It just gives a very, very good shine. Okay. And now, there are other accessories as well. This is the blue brush. The blue brush I use for, the, for cleaning the bathroom, especially the towels. And you can use it on the taps as well. And then, there's a yellow one for cleaning the kitchen. Like I said before, use it for your towels, use it for other places in the kitchen. And this green one is for cleaning the toilet, you know, the nook and crannies of the toilet. So you just clean it and you're happy all the germs are gone. Okay, so to start, I'm going to place this steam cleaner on top of this microfiber pad. You just place it there. Okay, and this is plugged in already. So I'm just going to turn it on. I've got my water in here already. So when that, this comes on, it's gonna glow red in the water reservoir. You have to wait until it turns blue. When it turns blue, you know it's ready to use. Okay? It's blue, so it is ready. Now, if you come up here, you can choose what floor type you want to use. So because I'm doing the wood laminate, I'm using that one. To, pre to, to change the floor type, you press this auto select button, okay? So now it's on and it's working. This is a swivel head. You can move it around, so it makes it really, really easy. Okay? And if you think you need more steam, you press this button up here. Okay, that will give it more steam, okay? So once you select the floor type you need, it's gonna give you the required steam for the floor type. Okay? So this is very easy. I'm not doing so much, like I, I'm not applying so much pressure as I would have done with my mop and um, bucket. Okay? And I'm happy that all the germs are being um, killed without me using any cleaning products. Okay? So, cleaning nicely. I had a little mark there before. Now this has taken it all off. Okay. So now I'm gonna take it over to my kitchen where I've got um, I've got a stone marble floor. Okay. So for me to use it on the stone marble floor, I have to press this button again, the auto select, and select the floor type that I need. So from wood laminate, it's gone to stone marble. So I'm gonna use that on here. You can see the steam coming out as well. Giving me a wonderful, fantastic clean. 
three of gems. Okay. So I'm going to turn this off now. To turn it off here. I'm going to turn it off so I can show you how to use the handheld steamer. So to take this off, you press this button here, okay, this button, pull it down and just press the, there's a button at the bottom, you press that as well to pick it off. I'm going to attach this hose. And this nozzle to use it on my oven just to show you the amount of steam it brings out to clean. So now, turn it on, it is red. So remember, <laughs> remember you have to wait for it to turn blue, then you would know it's ready to use. Okay, so let's just wait a bit. There it is, it is ready. And there's a button at the underneath here where you press to use it. Okay. So apply more pressure. If you want more pressure, you just turn this. Okay. It's giving a really good clean. The good thing about this is that you can use this product anywhere. It's seven in one. There's so many other accessories attached to it. You can use this product without thinking, oh, is it safe or, you know, it's, 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 it's using just water. So you know it's safe even for your children when you clean um, different places. Okay, this is just to give you an idea of how to use it in your oven. You can also use it on the knobs as well. You can use it in different places. Okay. Good. This is very easy to use and convenient. So I'm going to turn this off and change the nozzle just to show you how to use it on the windows and mirrors. Gonna use the squeegee. Take that one off and attach this this one. Make sure it is secure. Okay. So now we're gonna go to the window. If you look very well, you can see some streaks and fingerprints. Okay, so we turn this on. Remember, if it's red, it means it's not ready to use. Once it turns blue, you're ready to go. And don't forget the button underneath here. You need to press that to enable the steam to come out to be used. Okay? Okay, there it is. All the fingerprints are all gone. My daughter likes to do this with me because it's fun.
You can't see any streaks from the inside because it's doing such a wonderful, fantastic job. Okay, so that's basically to show you how to use the handheld steam cleaner. So this is a very good product. It's very easy to use. It's convenient. You know, I don't have to stress myself about using my mop and um, bucket anymore. You know, so this is an excellent product. It does the work. It's seven in one and it, um, it does um, what it says it does. So you know your house is clean and gem. Um, 